Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Season welcome three. back, everyone. We're kicking, been, a, we're kicking off season three. It's been a minute, guys. Been it's, a minute. it's been a while. Sorry. It has been a minute, actually. Yeah, we took a break. Uh, we took little a little nice break. vacation. We not took really. a break. We, not really, we, not really. We switched vacation. from coffee to beer. Uh, from sa Saturday mornings to uh, Friday uh, nights. Cheers. 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 By the way, guys, this is water. Cheers. That's this is this is sparkling. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. this is it's sparkling this is cider. Yo, but like, why are you afraid to say it's alcohol? Because I don't drink alcohol and this is water. Y'all can taste it. You you don't try it. Hey, it's carbonated was, water. This one sounds a little suspicious out there, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. This is vodka. Look, if this was vodka, would I be able to do this? Maybe you have a high tolerance. I mean, if it was water, you'd be able to drink more. Yeah. Oh. You're right. You're right. <laughs> you know what Andy just said? He's like, are hold on. I'm challenging you. It's because I got to pace myself because I'm eating, bro. So, okay. yeah. But it's Damn. water, though. You still get bloated, though. True. Oh, I understand. Okay. Yeah. It All right. is Oh, well, hold on, know. why are y'all going at it with me? Yo, yo, yo comment no. down below if y'all want to see this What the dude. fuck? <laughs> comment down below if y'all want to see this food drink. If we get 10 comments where it says Jose needs to drink, <laughs> we're Jose gonna, will We're going to make him. Gonna make him. Or you don't love the viewers. Yeah, but you're going to give me more than 10. The fuck? How many do you want? How many do you want? Hey, I want 50. It's been 365 days, a little bit more than I had a beer, so that many, that many likes or views. All right, 20 likes. 20 likes. 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20 likes. Let's 20 get 20. Bro, 365, you got 20, 20 bro. 20 likes on this video to get Jose uh, to drink alcohol on the podcast. Exactly, exactly, yeah. That sounds about right, right? Yeah, sounds, sounds about, about right. right. So it is now officially February 2021. We have yeah. made it this far. I know. That's actually a good statement because a lot of people have not made this far. RIP. RIP. RP. Yo, but this thing's gonna this thing's gonna be out what like the week of Valentine's? What is that? What is that? Yeah. I that Neither do I. February twelfth. <laughs> I Yo. think you might be onto oh. something, bro. Wait, really? Bonnie and Clyde. Yeah, Bonnie and Clyde died on that day. Hey, yo, that, that, that sounds like the perfect... Well, this like, is the Valentine's Day episode. Yeah, Valentine's Day episode. That sounds, like, that sounds like the best. You guys aren't wearing red, though. What the heck? Like, I, I got all, like, my nice, like... I'm not allowed to wear red. <laughs> Why do we gotta wear red, though? Why can't I wear blue? That's what I'm I'm not allowed yeah, to wear red, exactly. bro. Is it because red's, like, the sign of love and... I don't know. Just, like, colorful. Hey, you guys is that are... it? Hey, like, he's colorful. He's wearing colorful. No, but that like, is, that's red. a dope jacket. Like, hey, no, but, but like, yeah, but yeah, yeah but his camo even, pants. I didn't even fucking walk, bro. But you associated <laughs> red with like <laughs> Valentine's. Like, is it because red means love? Well, something? because roses, the roses, red hearts, and all that. Everything's red, bro. Red, pink, red lips, red white. Is that one the blue? Was it? Who's red? Who, who's red? Who's red? Uh, Crimson blood. 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 Okay. Bro, did you hear? Did you hear this guy? <laughs> <laughs> out of here I like dog what know. color is the sky oh. is it is it white or is well, it blue technically your blood is blue bro technically it's not blue though it's or, the light well baby blue or whatever okay okay technically i never gave a fuck or <laughs> you haven't even sit to anything bro <laughs> I know, right? well, I, was, I was drinking part of this yo has anybody ever like done a shopping spree as an not shopping spree as a killing spree on valentine's yeah, a lot of people have. What? Like serial killers? I serial killers. Nah, no, bro. Like real life. Oh, Not GTA. Yeah. Yeah. Like your 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 type of Valentine's is to go kill. That is some crazy shit. I mean, because you know, typically Valentine's Day, oh lovey dovey, mm -hmm. people make a big about. deal about it. But you know what? It also makes sense because the day that you know you want to spend time with whoever you love or your partner, whatever, and someone that doesn't have that, well, what else can they do? They but go crazy. Like, wow. I mean, they about? could just sit at home and watch movies. And but uh, people are fucking sick out there. Sci oh, sociopaths, yeah. A girl and a guy murdering people as but, a couple. Oh, uh, Bonnie and Clyde? No, I mean, yeah, Well, but see. Kind of like Bonnie and Clyde? They only oh, killed cops. The, the Sunset Strip killed dogs. The what? Oh, oh sunset, sunset. sunset. I never heard of that. Hollywood. Yo, 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 what? Educate us. Educate uh, okay, Jose. Uh, this is couple of people. Do they, it was a couple. Like, he's nerdy ass people. Like, weird ass people. In the eighties and shit, and like there were a couple who like murdering prostitutes and people and shit. So they would just like murder people for fun. They pick up hitchhikers and go, "Oh hey, you need a ride?" And then people would be, "Oh yeah, thank God, God bless you, thank you." And they get in the whip and fucking murder them and uh, 
they like they would shoot them or they would stab them oh, to yeah. death? Or um, you mean um, D- Doug Clark and Carol Bundy, right? Carol yeah. Bundy. Yeah. See, I, I started. I, See, I, I, the, the, I was thinking of Carol. Uh, Carol, Carol, ba- Carol Bastin. <laughs> <laughs> Carol Bastin. Hey, hey, you know she. Uh, a side note. Um, I just, I just recently heard. D- doesn't she actually ownership of the zoo now? Of the the Tiger Zoo. I, don't know. I think wow. she actually does have ownership she now. She killed her husband, and that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> but Carol going Bass. back to what you were talking about, Andrew, how many people did they kill? I think like 20 or 30. And yeah. the last time I heard this story, bro, I was working at a gas station, and I was listening to the podcast at like 3 in the morning, just mopping the fucking floor. Uh, that's what I would do. I listen to the podcast, the Serial Killer podcast. Uh-huh. Really good podcast. But uh, I don't know. I just like, because, I mean, you want to avoid getting murdered by a serial killer. You should <laughs> learn how to think like one, if that makes sense. Like, you're I'm right, you're I right. Like one, but like, I, I try to like put myself in a situation where like this guy's kind of weird. He, he might try to kill me once I stop. So you can understand like all the signs and all that. So, you yeah. so you're, yeah. More aware, yeah, you're, uh, uh, you're more aware. You're more aware. It's called the the social uh, psychology of it. Like the some shit like that. I think it's called the behavioral psychology of social, social killer. Like the way yeah. they behave, you know, like people. Mm-hmm. There's like certain traits. SBU. Like, no, no, yeah, no, 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 that's a... Uh, that's the was SBU's what, show, right? What was their their mo? The like, fuck is he talking about? <laughs> you talking to me, Car- Carol? And the, <laughs> Honestly, from what I remember, Doug. Shit, uh, what they like? Uh, they go on. They, they go on PCH. No, right yeah, but they, they all have like on a the, trait on the actual Santa's right, trip. Right, right, right. But when they target, I think they would target um, sex um, workers, yeah, like possibly. young. Because a lot, because a lot of people that target like sex workers, it's one is because a lot of them they're getting just started. And two, because they think like they're actually cleaning out, you know, bad people. The, a lot of a lot of psycho killers yeah. think that oh, like, like they're actually doing some sort of good, good to the world. Yeah. That's their that's, that's their mindset good. of yeah. it. Yeah. Sex workers in the name of God. Serial killers that have done that. Serial killers that have been like, oh, I'm killing all these hoes in the name of God. Like there's guys out there. There's actual serial killers that have done that. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, but back to those people. Uh, I was gonna say like most of the serial killers that from what like I've studied and stuff and like listened to the podcast and all that. They all have like similar traits as kids, and like, what was uh, that girl's traits was that her mom had some like disease where she like lost her memory, and like pretty much uh, neglected that girl, and like would say like, oh, you're not my daughter, you're not my daughter. And, like, that girl was like a young girl, like Carol, 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 He's gonna Carol, Carol Baskin, Baskin yeah. again. Yeah. You mean but, uh, Carol Bundy? Yeah, Bundy. Yeah. Bundy, yeah. So pretty much like she she get raped by her dad. Her dad would sleep with her and her little sister when they were young. Her dad would rape her. Her mom would abuse her. Uh, her mom would neglect her and, and like just hurt her. Uh, she got abused by a lot of guys. Abused by a lot of guys when she was younger. So by the time she met this guy, she was at like she never murdered before, but he was into murdering, and she felt deep for him. So because she fell in love with him so much, she was willing she's to starting with him. accomplishing so, him, right? It was like the first time she at felt first, love. Yeah. At first, she was like dating the girls, like helping, helping, you know, kind of like helping them out, and then it went from helping out to actually helping him kill. To her just killing on her own. Bam, then bam. Just killing and then her killing him. And like, it was, it was just a bunch of shit. But long story short, she was a really nice lady who would have been a normal lady if she wasn't abused and raped and she wasn't abused by men throughout her life. So, dude, it, it just. And I think, it, it, it just, I, I think he, um, he was convicted of six or more murderers, uh, victims that, that, that he, that, that, that they know of for him. And then I believe, um, for Carol, I think she got convicted of two. And then, and, they, they, they and then he, than and then, that, yeah, I think probably. And then, yeah, yeah. and then he got, um, uh, he got death row. I believe oh. he's still on death row. Where, in California? Wait, but yeah, in they, California, death They would row. do that like every year on Valentine's or it just started on Valentine's? No, they didn't even do it on Valentine's. No, it's just the 80s, the early 80s. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, damn. But then I believe, um, that guy also, she died in jail though. Really? I, yeah, she died in that jail. That guy was also into, into, into kids, like, like little boys. Oh, like. Oh. Sexually molesting. Was, I, if I remember correctly, I might, I might be mixing this up. I don't know. I'm kind of crossfaded, but uh, I believe he had like a like a allegedly like a, a boy allegedly was like, baby, like a little boy. He was uh kind of fucking with, and I think that's what caused her to like get jealous and shit. I guess. Oh, was, like, so he was putting the fucking attention to the boy instead yeah, of her. Like that, but at the same time, he was. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure. He might. I just remember he was cheating. I'm not sure if it was with the little boy or with somebody, but he was cheating on that on that bitch. That bitch went like. And 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 it's mm-hmm. so fucking crazy how that like that chick sees us as sees us as, as cheating and stuff instead of like the dudes molesting them, mm-hmm. you know how like messed up in the brain you have that's, to be. That's true. Because she's like, oh hell no! Now this little boy became competition for my man. You know she's about to get like her, her freaking ring. You would, her. I mean, you would think 
that you know you said her her childhood i mean she was actually messed up right like i mean so like, so like i mean normal thinking you know mindset oh, yeah, person wow. would be like oh um i'm turning you in you're i'm t- yeah, calling the cops yeah, but i think she probably maybe thought of that maybe from from what, what i've heard about it but she she wanted to just accomp- accomplish him. Well, maybe she thought it was normal because she maybe. got abused so much. You know, that she after did. that became her, her norm. She didn't say it was normal. She just said that she really, like, loved him. So she was down. Like, she was just down. Oh, she would fuck. do anything she for him? She was down anything for him. Bro, she I can't. Bought, I, she bought two guns in her name for them to use. That's how they got caught the fuck up, too, because... They found her. Oh, they had a trace. Like, he was like, I'm going to use this dumb bitch because she has no criminal history. Oh. I'm going to use this dumb bitch and get guns off of her and then use those guns to kill people. So then, yeah, he used her like that. He would use her and still like, kind of like abuse her. And, like, I, it, it was. Yo, crazy. that's, that's so crazy. I, I got I to gotta know. I got to learn what that dude do because I can't even get a, a text back in this movie. <laughs> <laughs> and I think, I think yeah, actually, I think, yeah. I think actually um, in one of the cases, uh, Maybe even two of the cases. I think he severed a head, and then like he did sexual things to the head. Yeah, yeah. What, what, while the dead was like, yeah, what the was severed like fuck? decapitated? Yeah, decapitated. Yeah. The, was it called? He he really yeah he he did he decapitated the head, and then, and then he, he, he like, performed oral sex. Hey, there's stories of guys who will kill boys. Like there's this guy, John Wayne Gacy or some shit, the serial clown, clown killer. Fuck, I can't talk. Mm-hmm. But uh, clown he like, killer killed this kid. I think and like he like got his body and, like. Made him into like a wax figure or sex doll type of They use actual horror. Damn. Like, like House of Wax type of stuff? I don't ever seen that movie, but yeah, he like. Where they use them. bodies and they wax them. Oh, like, yeah, he makes that and he just like kept fucking that shit and like used the body to preserve oh, it. He just like, preserve the body. It was gross as fuck. I remember just listening to this the shit and I'm fuck? like, damn, like, I, I would just kill myself if I was in a situation like that. If I can't get out, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna like be alive. Oh. Like, shit. Like, fuck that. Yo, but like, are they are they born with like different chromosomes or something, or is it just? You know what? I I'm not really sure what it's called, but um, it's a lot of there's there's actually a chromosome. That they call it the serial killer chromosome, mm-hmm. and they found that most serial killers do have that specific that in common? chromosome in common with different serial killer cases. Dude, really? Oh. All I know is either child abuse, fucking rape, uh, drugs, uh, neglect. Um, Abandonment and uh, there's all kinds of people. Yo, some people are just fucking crazy. Some people but, are literally just born with a perfect life, loving parents, and they're just fucking born fucked in the head. Something's just wrong with them, and they just murder people. So, Chad, mm. yeah, yeah, it, 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 it <laughs> yo, fun. but like, my, can people actually, like, say they, they're born with that chromosome and then recover? I, yeah, can they be, can they recover? Because, like, so, well, hold so, on, but see, okay, go ahead. Go for ahead. Like, okay, so for, so for how many freaking humans, like, out of so many humans, how many are, you know, uh, like, what's the ratio? Like, out of how many humans, how many, how many are, are, are serial killers? Out of all those humans, how many are actually born with that chromosome? That's what I was going to say. Mm. I probably feel like that number is really high, actually. That's what I'm saying. Like, Probably so like one, one uh, may, may, exactly. Maybe a lot of more people have that chromosome. It's just now we go to stage two, like the upbringing, the way they're, you know, like you were saying, the like triggers this, yeah, that activate it, maybe that, the, the triggers that activate it, mm. you know, and if, and if people actually have the power to fight it off. I don't understand though, because like, dude, like, we're Mexican. We got our asses beat like motherfuckers. Like, I'm pretty sure no offense to white people or Asian people. I know black people can handle the shit we went through. You know, so like, they got whipped and shit. Not, not to be a dick, but like, not, not to be a dick, but. I'm just saying, white people and Asian people, they got the type of abuse abuse that we got, Hispanic people or, or black people get from our parents. Like, if they got abused the same way, we got, I feel like they'd be more serial killers because mm. our parents, my, dude, I uh, can't say Yo, it. straight shit, straight yeah, shit, I yeah. It, fucking child abuse like a motherfucker, but I just see it as... Like a belt or whatever. Oh, what just being strict. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, just strict. discipline. Yeah, just and that's discipline. like, that's why... Yeah. yeah. No credit to me. I heard it somewhere else. They're like, well, why do you think like Mexican kids never shoot up their freaking the schools? Ooh, yeah. Because you get bullied at home, bro. Yeah, you get bullied at, school, at home. Your family, everywhere you go, you get these press. So you just gotta be like, you know, I gotta toughen the fuck up. You know? So when you go to school, I mean, it's like you're not. Like, out. So you, know, you don't gotta shoot up no school. You already know what's up. You just gotta toughen up. But see, if more white kids were to go through the same environment that we've gone through, I feel like they wouldn't be that much bullshit. Time, that makes sense. Is there more? Is there more mm-hmm. Caucasian serial killers than like yeah. any other race? Yeah, yeah. I think actually yes. Yeah, there is. More That's statistically, crazy. 
I don't understand why. I'm not trying to sound racist. That's 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 interesting. No, I mean, why I, though? Statistically, yeah. Fuck if I know. I'm pretty sure if you go to Africa, the numbers gonna be like black people are higher because there's more black people. Well, no more, shit. There's more white people over here with better lifestyles that probably have nothing better to do. No you think that's what it is like because they're know. just bored, so some, they want to go. Some kids will actually kill for boredom. Other people will kill because they're possessed. Other people will kill because they're lean. Other people will do it for love. Dude, people will kill for a lot of things. People will kill for money. That's true. That's no. That, mm-hmm. That's true. You know, that's like, dude, it just, Yo, but I'm not yeah. saying like I'm not saying any of you guys right here are serial killers, you know. And don't don't incriminate yourself. But allegedly, oh my you gosh. know, allegedly, <laughs> if you had a like, not, I don't want to say a fetish. What is it called? A, um, a kink? No. Well, yeah, kind of like a kink. What like what sets you off or whatever, you know. And you had to do it during like Valentine's. What would you do? What kind of murder would you do? Oh, like a what allegedly, if scenario? Allegedly, a what allegedly, if scenario? allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. Sorry, so kind of get it, nah. kind of get it. You got to get into like the serial killer's no, mind, dude. No, no, allegedly, no, 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 no. allegedly, allegedly. allegedly. Oh, no. Or, or allegedly. how about this? How about this? Right. How about this instead? I know. Why am I thinking about it? Honest thing about but, it. How about this instead? But hold on, no. Let me get into this. So, allegedly, right? What I would do? I will wait till twelve o'clock midnight, right? I'll open the door, or I'll go into the window, and then I'll get my ass in bed and go to sleep. That's what I would do. There we go. You know what I would do? <laughs> Boy, I was not. Well, Juan, what would you do since you I thought about question. it? He's you, thinking you, about you've it. been He's thinking about I'm it. Thinking about it because I'm like, I'll, like you guys are here. I'll say something that I probably do. I'll probably just put sandbags on someone's legs and throw them in the water. <gasps> you know what? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't know wow. what call, but right here, fucking beard. snip it, cut it. Oh, oh. try to walk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, instead of allegedly. In, I would, instead I, of uh, mur- murder, <laughs> what is your limit? What is the most like insane thing you would do for someone you love? Oh, I, I thought we were talking about murder. Well, I was about like, well we I, could. Would you murder Bro. someone you love? No, because then oh, fuck. Nah. It depends on what country I'm in, to be honest. <laughs> You're right. You're right. <laughs> You're right. Well, Mexico, that might be a different answer. It's a, it's a whole thing. If it was the there. apocalypse, then. Okay. Hell yeah. If it's for survival, oh yeah. It's like GTA. Shoot first, ask questions later. <laughs> um, that's, uh, <laughs> damn, that's a good question though. Would you murder for somebody? You... I wouldn't, unless it's like because there's a lot of people that be like, "Oh, take, babe, I'll take a bullet for you." Oh, oh no. fuck you, me. Uh, <laughs> but would you shoot a bullet for them? I said it depends what country I'm in. But what? Why? Why? Why is it for a me? It would be a survival. Oh, America, America, if America, if it was like oh, the apocalypse, oh, if there was zombies America, or whatever. Right? That for survival, then I mean, it's a free for all out yeah, there. Yeah. So, like, okay, there, that's a different situation, you know. But still, but this guy, why does it matter what country you're in, though? Well, because I'm, I'm in Mexico. I can just get Juan that shit. is not. He doesn't care if he has that shit in his conscience. He doesn't give a shit. He cares about getting caught. Yes. Oh, so that's I mean, why you in about. Mexico you have a. Um, if you're telling me I can murder somebody and I wouldn't get caught, I probably wouldn't murder somebody for revenge. If I, if someone is for revenge, okay, there. You will the, pick him up in his no, pickup no, truck, take him to Mexico. Love. Yes, if it wasn't against the law, if I could get away with it, if it was purge day and they were like, "Oh, I've been waiting all year for this shit," yes, I probably would. If I was okay, so yo, like yo, a yo, purge yo, scenario. Okay, okay. Well, now we're now we're explaining the shit. So you would remember allegedly, 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 you would allegedly for love. Okay, you would kill for love, kill but for not money. in the United States of America yes. because you would go to jail. I would kill for money, bro. I would. I, I, yes, I mean, it's kind of fucked up, but if I had to, say I was in fucking Asia and I was getting sold for parts and shit. <laughs> and me, like, well, there's like, a difference between surviving for, for your life and fucking killing for okay, love, bro, my bro. I wouldn't kill for love. Okay, love. there we go. Okay, That's the answer. Would. I would. Well, but what you about, would, so what about? you would kill sir, for survival? Yeah. I would kill for survival. Who would it? Well, I, would, I mean... Shrimps. I, see, that, that's what I'm saying. So... So, if we would kill for survival, do we have that chromosome too? Of killing? Or is it just a conscious thing? But because like, because it's everyone... It's a fight or flight. Because Some people every, can't kill. Some people can't kill. Some people right. just can't pull no, the trigger. Huh? No. Do you just like, kill me? Niggas, I think I've been hit so much by my parents that I can't pull the trigger. You feel me? Like, I, I think really? I, yeah. If I had to kill, I mean... Like, like look. I don't want to harm anybody. Like, you, don't, you wouldn't feel it no more. Look, I don't want to harm anybody. I'm a pacifist, to be honest. I don't want to be violent. But if it came to me or that person say I was in the army and I was in Afghanistan and they were shooting at me and it was either I shoot them and I kill them or they kill me, I'm going to fucking kill them because fuck them. I don't fucking know who the fuck you are. I know who the fuck I am. Yeah, but, that, okay, well, that but that's different survive. though because again, I mean, no, no, no disrespect to the military, but I mean, that's what you're there for, yeah. Yeah. you know? But like, I'm talking about like, you know, here in the streets of, you know, um, California, you're... 
you, you're saying that you've been, you know, you've been uh, hit by your parents enough time to not, you know, to feel numb to pulling the trigger to somebody. Yeah, it depends. I mean, if he's inside your, if he's inside, okay, but don't put it in a scenario where it benefits this you not going to jail. This is why <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. That's what it is. It is. If someone hurt my parents, I love my parents so much that I would probably kill those people. Does that make sense? That's love right there, bro. It don't have to be no. That's 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 love. That's love. Someone hurts my family. Yeah. I am willing to pull the trigger if someone. Trigger. See, if I was in that situation, I'd be pissed as fuck. But I wouldn't kill them because I feel like that would be the oh, easy way for them. Torture, torture. So you would rather have them beat the jail time? No, well, torture, well, well, well. We have to step outside, put them yeah. in the cabin, talk for a couple of days, and then take them to jail. Oh, okay. Torture. He's not gonna have no ankles, dog. Oh my god. He's gonna be in a wheelchair. Look, man. If, if I can get away with it, like if it was purged, like I said, oh yeah. Well, if everyone can get away with it, everyone would be fucking shit up. Yeah, fucking killed. Then everybody be fucking psycho. I mean, you're a freaking killer and shit. Yeah, I'm just saying, I would if I could, but I can't, so I won't. So maybe a lot of a lot of us would be, you know, serial killers, but we just have like that, you know, a lot of us believe like in God, like you, sh you should not kill or you know, or don't kill or whatever. Not no, you should not steal. Sorry, yeah, <laughs> but you still not kill. Yeah. yeah. Or you know, we have like the con. You know, we're conscious to like not but, kill. I just see it in this way, like. If people are willing to join a gang and kill for a gang, people are willing to join a fucking narc organization and kill for that organization, or a mafia, mm -hmm. or even the government, even though it's legal, and you're willing to kill for a cause, mm -hmm. you're definitely down to kill for some love. It just depends who you are. Yeah. I'm, but, just not that much, I'm not that type of simp. You know, I'm not going to simp over a bitch and kill somebody like that. Like, but you know what? You put it You put in good perspective, though. Mm -hmm. Because look, a lot a lot of those people do, do, a lot of those people kill for that, kill like in a gang or stuff like that, because they don't know better. Okay, so or that's all so, they know. Exactly. Yeah. So then, yeah. when it comes to serial killers, is that the same, the same thing? Because they don't know better. Oh, serial killers are actually some of the most smartest people you'll ever meet. They're oh, de oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. But their upbringings, like, uh, of, yeah, I'm telling you, yeah. It has or, to or they're, they're. That's what I'm saying. They don't know better. Or, or in some cases, they're non empath like they don't feel anything that shit, they yeah have and and just to feel something anything they, they that's how they fill that void Sometimes uh, they don't feel anything. Yeah. the only feel they ever the only thing they ever get is like like that excitement that adrenaline from killing mm -hmm. that's what they get addicted to more than anything that it's like a drug to them like fucking dead bodies yo but i wonder if like I wonder if uh, oh it's the apocalypse oh, it's the apocalypse oh, it's, it's, happening. Apocalypse. it's happening it's happening it's happening, it's happening. Uh, yeah, thanks. That's all the time. I, I, I wonder. <laughs> well, if, was there more serial killers back then than now? Yeah, yeah. I think it's. You know why? Because I think it was easier that back then. Yeah, than, than DNA what it is now. evidence Before is so DNA, powerful now. Before DNA, there was a lot. And actually, back then. They weren't even called serial killers. It was just people handling their business back then. Dead ass. Shootouts. Yeah, shootouts. Mm -hmm. no. I don't know. Hunting. Saw how we were with the Native Americans. We could be, That's true. We could call the soldiers serial killers because they murdered. I mean, but it was for a cause. They have a cause. Well, that makes it okay, but it's like you're still fucking killing people and shit. I, I, that, that's true though. How do you if, define? If a lot of people were yeah, like, there was yeah. no penalty of going to jail, a lot of more people would kill. I know, Obviously, the military just to kill because it makes you feel legal. It's like it's you like, know what? Th that's something that a lot of people don't think about. Yeah. But when that whole thing at the the Capitol happened, yeah. you know that they actually found I I don't know. It was like forty. Or yeah, 40, 40 plus or right. 20 plus of them actually were involved in the supremacist organization. Damn. They found that many of them. Well, it's like people. Really? So it's like a cover for them. You know what I mean? It's like so people, that's yeah. crazy to think about. It's like people that like that kill people that go inside their houses. You know, when like, you know, because is it true that if you mean like a uh, if some, if someone trespasses, like, like trespasses or it breaks into your house and you fucking bam, you smack yeah, them. Yeah. So no, that's what I'm saying. I'll fucking shoot you. And that's why, that's why a lot of people don't, like, they, they don't <laughs> hesitate to fucking pull the trigger because they know, they, know. They, they have no penalty. If I don't know who the fuck you are and you're going into my house and it's three in the morning, I'm fucking hitting you with the bat. Stab you with a fucking shoot <laughs> just, you with your gun. Just, like, just leave him alone, guys. I'm just saying, like... Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. I'm allegedly. just saying, no, no, not even allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'll fuck your ass up if you go. Oh my God. I'm like, I don't even know you. Like, I'm going to shoot first, ask questions later. Maybe we hired a stripper for you, bro. I don't give a fuck. Bro, he's going to only kill if it's a guy. If it's a female, you don't give a fuck. Yeah, if it's a girl, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she can kill me too. I don't know. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> little hider. Yeah. Exactly. I, I'm just saying, like, I don't trust people at all. Like when it comes to like people on the streets, like my friends always make fun of me, but 
I'm always like super sussed out. Like I'm always like like on some like six sense army shit. But mm. I think that's because that's what they tell me. They tell me to always be like. Yeah. But that was your mm-hmm. training. Yeah. yeah. So like I just got used to it. Like, I'm always like. Be aware of your surroundings. Like, yeah. I got parked right there. Oh, you know, you know, I get all fucking and my friends are like, yo, what you woo? Like, Straight nah, shit. Like, they kill me and shit. Like I watch too much Narcos, dog. Too much, too much fucking Godfather and shit. Hey, I love the Godfather. Movie. Yeah. Yes. This wasn't uh, such a lovely episode as like, our first ever Valentine's <laughs> episode. But I wanted to I was do something the, different it was for Valentine's though, yeah. Day this year. Because, you know, it's not always all lovey-dovey. I would send poison and flowers, guys, or should, candy. Yeah, you would so have bad. one of those poison rings Allegedly, back then? I, I would send poison to... Uh, you know, so that was your master plan that yeah. you were keeping a secret, poison huh? Poison the candy, and then they would die. Oh. I don't oh, think they die like that. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> so <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Lady in the 1800s who had five husbands and all five of them. God damn. She uh she made she them points. all get life insurance and then she would feed them a meal and with that meal she would kill them. There was a lot of that back then. Yeah, five times she did that five times and collected so much money and she never got caught. She, that was Dang. back in the 1800s. How are you gonna? Yeah. Know? Mm-hmm. Husband, oh my husband died from this. I'm like, all right. She she would just move around. They have the technology to do it. Yeah. Yeah. She dude. Made bank. I'm like, that's my Back then, it was like, you're all the dead. Well, everyone, we hope you enjoyed this very yeah, different yeah. Valentine's Day episode. Um, Heck yeah, guys. Like, it's good to be subscribe. back. It's good to be back. Like, it is. Let us know what back. you guys think. Leave a like, leave a comment. Heck what yeah, are some other know. murderers, Valentine's Day, lovers, couples, murders that you know about? What or you, other you know, topics. What would you do if you, if you were a serial killer? I'm not saying you are. Allegedly. You guys are amazing. Allegedly. You guys are special. Okay? Stop. Allegedly. Stop, Andy. <laughs> what would you, how would you guys kill on Valentine's Day? Jesus Christ. Jesus. Allegedly. A what if scenario. You know, I have any idea how many times I've seen it on the YouTube comments? Like, oh, I would have done this and I would have gone over the guy. I'm like, bro, like, we want that, Andy. We want that, Andy. We want that. You're going to get caught on like, They're not going to do it, though, because they're, this is the, they're the most amazing people. It's the internet. I don't fucking know. Yeah. I don't know, man. Sign it up, Alex. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Subscribe. Three, two. The Ten Crack Commandments. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>